is Chelsea and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be unboxing the April Shelf Love Crate. It is $30 plus shipping and handling, and they send you a newly released, um, within the last month or two, uh, YA sci-fi or fantasy book, along with some bookish goodies to go along with the theme. Uh, this is our April box, so I do believe the theme was Magical Manipulators. Um, so let's open it up and see what we got. So it looks like this is going to be our booklet here. This is the art that they have for this month. These spoilers are going to be on the inside, so I will look those up as I need them, but I'm not going to look right now. And then next month's theme is Written in the Stars. From what I have seen on their Instagram, I do believe it is currently sold out. However, they do the renewal every month on the 1st, so the May theme, Written in the Stars. All the people that are currently subscribed, including myself, will be charged on May 1st for that. And if there's anybody who wants to cancel, they do that before the 1st. And then sometimes if they have any boxes left over, they will put those back up. Otherwise, I'm thinking you're going to have to get the June box. The first item that we have here is soap. This one is apparently water soap. This is by Willow and Honey. Um... I'm actually not entirely sure what this is from. Let me double check. So apparently this is a spirit gem type of soap and there are apparently some sort of elemental gems included in whatever book we have this month. They did have different gem soaps for the different boxes. So I believe you could get fire, water, air, or earth. I'm actually really, really happy with water. Blue is like my favorite color and I think this is a really, really cute soap. It's not perfectly like one color it has the different ebb and flow of it and I think this is really adorable the next thing that we have this month looks like a tote bag so this is an Aelin and Rowan tote bag from the throne of glass series I am not caught up on this series but I think this is absolutely gorgeous artwork I've heard many amazing things about the series and this is a really nice item to have in a book box like this amazing and this was made by Morgana O Anagram who I believe did something in our last box as well the next item that we have here is a coaster this does say in our spoiler card that it is inspired by the book roar that is not one that I have read but I think this coaster is gorgeous and it says I am lightning made flesh colder than falling snow unstoppable as the desert sands riding the wind and this is one that has a it feels sort of plasticky on the top, like it was almost maybe not quite laminated, but like that. And then there is the cork backing, which is great. We did get our bonus Lunar Chronicles card this time, and this one is Queen Lavana. So this, I believe, is the third Lunar Chronicles trading card. We got Scarlet last month, and I believe the one that I did not get was Cinder for the first month they started this. Um, these are just absolutely gorgeous. I love the back on them. And then we did receive a bookmark. This is from Ink and Wonder Designs. This was a bookmark that they did tell us, or they did tell us that we were going to be receiving something from Ink and Wonder Designs in this box. So this was one of their spoilers. Um, we did not know exactly what it was, and this is a super cute bookmark. It says, her heart was a river that carried her to the sea. That's by Lee Bardugo. And it does look like this is from the Six of Crows series. And then the next thing that we have here is a sleep mask. This is actually going to be really, really nice when I go on my honeymoon with my husband. We have a like 10 hour plane ride and it is going to be one of those ones where we'll be doing most of our flying at night. Uh, and this is just really, really well done. It looks amazing. And it says she moved like a storm someone had given steel to. This is by Alwyn Hamilton, and it's from Rebel of the Sands. And then we have our postcard with this amazing art on there. I do not know who's been doing the artwork for these postcards, but it is absolutely gorgeous. I love these so much. And again, it's not telling me who did this in my spoiler card. Um, I have my one from last month right here. They are just absolutely gorgeous. I love the artwork on these so much. And it looks like we are down to our book already. So we do have the book for this month, which is Ash, Prince 
Obsessed by Laura Sebastian. This is one that I believe has just come out this month. Like I remember having it come out in our bookstore. It was one that I wasn't too sure about getting um, because most of my book haul this month was manga. I will leave that link down below in case you guys have not seen that yet, but I did not buy like any actual novels this month. And it was very intriguing and I just haven't picked it up, which I'm super glad I didn't. I don't want to spoil myself too much for the exact plot of this book, so I'm just going to be going off this very small synopsis they gave us in the spoiler card. But apparently this is a world full of intrigue and deception and we're following a foreign princess as she tries to navigate through that. So I think that is going to be really amazing and if it has anything to do with magical manipulators, our theme for this month, I'm assuming there's going to be some sort of magical power as well. I absolutely love this cover. And we did also receive a signed book plate to go in the book as well as a bookmark that matched the artwork from our spoiler card. And then also in our spoiler card, it looks like we do receive a letter from the author as well. I am looking forward very much to reading this book. I absolutely love this box. For $30 plus a little bit of shipping per month, you get a brand new released hardcover YA book plus other bookish goodies and I am super excited about it. They have some amazing things every month. I absolutely love the things that we got and I can't wait to read this. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up to let me know. Leave me a comment down below letting me know if you've read this book yet. I know it just came out, but I'm super interested to see what you guys think of it. Subscribe to this channel if you would like to see more videos. I do have videos up every Monday and Thursday, so I will see you then. Bye!